Hi folks, I'm in Amalfi in Italy, a city that once ruled the Mediterranean. What is Amalfi famous for? Well, for having ruled the Mediterranean a thousand years ago, for being the center of one of the most beautiful coastlines in the world, for being stuffed with tourists throughout the year, but it's also famous throughout Italy for the supreme quality of its lemons and other lemon-like citrus fruit. As you can see, this slightly bumpy lemon is about twice the size of a normal lemon you get here in the Italian supermarkets. Still, it's pretty small even for its variety, and it's by far the smallest of those yellow citrus fruit cultivated around here. Some of them are the size of my head. So this one is the famous Amalfi lemon, not to be confused with the Amalfi citron. This lemon, well, it's a lot bigger than a normal lemon, and the special thing about it, it's extremely aromatic. Now let's put this to the test. As you can see, a lot of the size is just a tick rind. I guess, well, it's always very hard to say what citrus fruit hybridized with what other citrus fruit. So this Amalfi level reminds me a lot of those giant Amalfi citrons which are being cultivated around here. The funny thing is everybody I ask has a different name for each yellow citrus fruit variety around here. But pretty much everyone agrees that this is the normal Amalfi lemon. Very famous in Italy and much more sought after it, much more expensive than the normal lemon. So this should be a citrus limon. Lemon in English. Let's try this one. First the rind and then the juicy inside. Well, the right is bitter, but also slightly sweet. It's edible. It's used together with the juice to make the famous limoncello, one of the famous, one of the most famous liquors of Italy. Now let's try the inside. The right was already very nice and aromatic. Hmm. Yep, yeah, it's maybe a little bit more aromatic than. A normal lemon. Cannot see a huge difference here. Yeah. Yeah, I would say the taste of the inside is also more delicate than that of a normal lemon. But the biggest difference is in the rind. It's a little bit sweeter and a little bit more edible than the rind of a normal lemon. You use both the rind and the juice to make the famous limoncello liquor. You just remove the white pith in between, which is just bitter. Basically, you squeeze out the juice, then you soak the rind until the pith becomes waterlocked and soft and basically halfway dissolved in water. Then you scratch it out, and then you use this outside yellow skin also for the limoncello. Basically, you pickle it for several weeks or months in alcohol. Okay, let's try again the rind. Yeah, not bad for a lemon rind. Not as sweet as a kumquat or a calamansi, but not bad. Okay, folks, this was the famous Amalfi lemon. Don't confuse it with the Amalfi citron. Stay tuned for more citrus fruit videos for from beautiful southern Italy and don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe.